Welcome to the Garden Kitchen. We are a seed to table project by the University of Arizona Pima County Cooperative Extension. And today we're going to talk about chili, specifically mole. So first we're going to start with some broth. And then we're going to heat the broth until it simmers. And what we're going to put in here is our chilies. So we're going to drop those in to rehydrate. As well, we're going to use some a half a cup of raisins, a couple of whole cloves of garlic, and I'm going to give that a little stir and let that come to a simmer. Meanwhile, we're going to put a saute pan onto a stove and we're going to preheat it. So I'm going to do about a tablespoon of whole cumin seeds, a few whole cloves, and coriander seeds. I'm going to pour in some cinnamon. I'm going to turn my heat off and I'm going to put these over onto a plate to cool completely before I grind them. And now we're going to toast the nuts and seeds that we're going to use in the mole. So I'm gonna give this a little stir. I'm also going to put a little bit of oil in here because we're gonna fry these. Next, we're gonna move on to our fresh ingredients that are gonna be in the sauce. So we get the onions in the pan and we keep them moving around. We're gonna saute them just until they're brown on the edges. We have all of the moisture cooked out of the onions. They're starting to turn brown. So what I'm gonna do now is take a couple of tablespoons of tomato paste and put that in the pan. So we're gonna start with our cooled spices. They're ground up nice and fine. That's what we're looking for. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put in the nuts and seeds. I'm going to take the remainder of my oil and go ahead and pour it into the nuts and seeds and then grind them until they're smooth. So our seeds are a little dry, so I'm gonna add just a touch of broth to be able to make a nut butter out of this. Now that I have this nice, smooth nut and seed butter, we're gonna start adding in our vegetables. So let's start with our onion mixture. I'm gonna put a little bit more broth and we're gonna keep blending. When your onions are smooth, start adding the chilies in little by little with more of the broth. And now for the final and best ingredient, chocolate. The darker, the better. About two ounces. You can make it chocolatey if you like, but it does make it a little sweeter. And there you have it smoky chocolate mole, absolutely delicious. 